What's going on guys? This is the Centrepreneur here today with a new video. Today I wanted to bring you the first impressions of something I finally got my nose on. I actually had to buy a small decant off eBay <laughs> to, to finally get this. Can't find it anywhere now. Uh, it's by Paco Rabanne and it's Invictus Aqua. You know the regular Invictus is one of my favorite designer fragrances of all time. I think it's one of the all-time greats for the club. But uh, whenever I talk about it in any of my videos, there's always somebody that says, screw Invictus, I like Aqua better. Man, Aqua should be on this list. And I'm like, I don't know, maybe it should. <laughs> but anyway, I finally pulled the trigger on uh, a five mil of this, and I wanted to give you my first impressions today. So without further ado, let's put it on. Now, I am going to put it right here because I'm doing another first impressions video in two seconds, so <laughs> I need more room. But anyway, I've got it on, guys. I haven't smelt it yet. <laughs> so let's see what I think of Invictus Aqua. Really? <laughs> okay, yeah. That just strikes me as a more wearable version of the regular Invictus, like... Okay, it's a more oceany Invictus, you know, that makes more sense. The original Invictus is a little bit... It's a little bit hard to handle for some people, and I can see why. It's very synthetic, it's very fruity, it's very in your face, but... You know, this is good. This is good, it's definitely more subdued, more casual. I could see this being a real sexy, real sexy date fragrance. Uh, not in that like you're gonna knock some girl's socks off with it or whatever, but like it just seems really safe and I can't see why you wouldn't find this sexy. It's fruity, it's a little synthetic, you got that little bubblegum vibe and it's like an aquatic too at the same time. Hmm. You know, I like it. I'm not crazy about it. It's going to take some time to see if I'll actually pounce on a bottle of this, uh, which is unfortunate because they're getting harder and harder to find, but ah, I don't know, man. It's good. It's really good, but I've already got fragrances that do what this does, and ah, I don't know if I need a second trophy sitting on my shelf. <laughs> the Invictus bottle. <laughs> Anyway guys, uh, this has been my first impressions of Invictus Aqua. I know this has taken a long time to get my nose on this one. It's good. It's what I expected it to be, basically. I'll say that. Anyway guys, what do you think of Invictus Aqua? Let me know down in the comments. Uh, is this one going to grow on me? Is this one that grows on you or is it just what it is, what I'm smelling right now? It's just a nice aquatic take on the original. Um, I don't really smell anything different, but maybe that'll change. Anyway, let me know. Let me know your thoughts on Invictus Aqua, uh, especially ranked among other awesome summer fragrances. How good do you think it actually is? Guys, this has been The Centrepreneur. If you enjoyed this short first impressions, please subscribe to my YouTube channel if you haven't done so already. Please toss me a big thumbs up for this video, and have an awesome day, guys. I hope to see you in the next one. Invictus Aqua. Finally! <laughs>